Hello everyone. Welcome to our new video. Today we'll take a look at the 5 best J bar racks that are available on the market. I tried to make the list based on their popularity, quality, price, durability, user opinions and more. If you need more information about these products, please check the link in the description section below. And make sure you subscribe to more videos. Okay so let's get started with the video. Starting at number 5. Ah Rack's Double Folding J Bar Rack. The truck rack fit my 2004 GMC Sierra perfectly. I opted to use the clamps rather than permanently attaching it and installed it by myself in the dark with a headlamp. The kayak mounts hold my 12 feet 9 inches SOT tandem as well as my 12 foot sit in fishing kayak with no problem. My only complaint is that I lost the tightening screws for one of my mounting racks in transit while traveling without a kayak in place. This was my own fault because I probably did not have it securely tightened all the way. My truck is lifted so being able to collapse the kayak racks is helpful to keep my overall height down when not using my kayaks. At number 4. Thule Hull A Port Rooftop Kayak Carrier Silver. This order was a disaster from the beginning. I made the mistake of ordering this product in haste, thinking I was ordering Thule Hula A Port Arrow. So this is my mistake. When I went to return the product, I was informed there was a return shipping charge. After thinking about it, I decided to try and product and keep it if it worked. When I opened the box, which had an enormous amount of packing tape on the edges I saw some of the hardware in Ziploc bags and was used. This added to my frustration, since this was not the product I originally wanted and I went back to the vendor's customer service. At number 3. Lifetime Warranty TMS 2 Pairs J Bar Rack. One of the reasons why you should think about buying this J-Bar rack is because the mechanism is such that the kayak will be secured on either side. There is a minimum load on the base. As a result, the load on the roof is also on the lower side. Moreover, with the width of 36 inches, you will have no complaints at all while using it for carrying the kayak with you. In addition to that, all the hardware which you will ever need for carrying it around is included. There is a rust-resistant coating which makes it last for a longer period of time. Moreover, it can handle 75 pounds of weight which is an added advantage. Thus, not only it is versatile but pretty durable. At number 2. Ah Rack's J-Bar Rack. The second time I used this the bolts came loose and the plast pieces that allow you to tighten them fell off on the highway. They shifted and my yak almost fell off of my car. I had to pull over but couldn't retighten them since the plastic hand screws fell off. This product is dangerous. I installed it properly. I can't believe it fell off after being so tight and the plastic pieces are just gone. I bought these to support transporting a 19-foot sea kayak over 2,500 miles. I knew already that at highway speeds the length of my kayak would cause it to move on or indeed move my foam blocks and a set of tule racks. This was driving me nuts. Finally at number 1. Sportrack Folding Kayak Carrier. They do a good job of transporting your kayak. They appear, solid. It is easy to adjust the vertical arm to upright, or, to fold flat when not in use. They are uncomplicated in their attachment to your existing roof rack, and, with different length supplied bolts, they should fit almost any roof rack. A few common sense things to keep in mind. If your vehicle has a high roof, and, you have a heavy kayak, it is a stretch, literally, to load your yak. Also, because the kayaks are carried upright, you need to able to reach high enough to flip the kayaks past vertical towards centerline. The rack is great. I used it to replace a set of Thule J hooks that don't fold down. It is easy to install and solid on my Yakima bars. But. Dot the straps are an accident waiting to happen. I loaded the boats for a three hour trip and one of the straps was halfway torn through by the time I reached my destination. I discarded the companion strap and used an old set for the return trip. Thanks for watching, I hope you liked the video, if you found it helpful please remember to leave a like comment and subscribe to my channel for more videos, if you have any question related to this product you can heave a comment below and I'll get back to you as soon as I can.